All right, we are back here live at the College Hills Swim and Racquet Club this morning near the Red Arroyo. Beautiful morning out here. We've had people walking the Red Arroyo. It's a nice morning to do so. We're sitting in the 60s right now. We got dew points in the low 50s. So still a nice morning out there. Lots of sunshine, feeling good, light breeze. It's a nice morning to start off your Monday. Let's take you right now to downtown San Angelo. Lots of clear skies, not even a cloud in the sky to start off your uh, Monday morning. Temperatures in the 60s. Area wide, we're mainly in the 60s as well. We're going to be warming up into the uh, 70s very soon, then 80s, and eventually the low 90s to top off during the afternoon hours today. Dew points this morning sit mainly in the 50s. Like I said, low to mid 50s here in San Angelo. A little bit more muggy air off to the southeast. Dew points in the upper 50s to lower 60s. That more humid air is going to make its way to the northwest as we get towards the uh, late evening hours and especially as we get into Tuesday, and that'll last for the rest of the week. So we've been dealing with this dry desert air the last several days. Going to be feeling more tropical as we get towards your Tuesday and for the rest of the week. So enjoy that low humidity while we still have it in place across West Texas. Winds right now out of the south, between about 5 and 10 miles an hour. Still relatively calm winds uh, for your Monday morning. Those will pick up a little bit out of the south through the late morning into the early afternoon hours. Eventually, these winds are going to turn out of the southeast between about 10 and 15 miles an hour. That'll bring in that more humid, muggy air as you get towards tonight and then eventually into the overnight hours as well as you get towards Tuesday. So your morning headlines, mainly sunny conditions today, increasing humidity levels thanks to those southeasterly winds, an average summer week ahead. So we're in the middle part of June. Average highs now are in the low 90s. We're going to be in the low 90s for today, eventually mid to upper 90s to get towards the end of the week. No triple digits over the next five days. That's some good news, but with increasing humidity levels, it's still going to feel rather hot across the area uh, over the next week. So satellite radar, not not tracking much here in the state of Texas. We are dry and clear. Temperatures in the 60s in West Texas, 70s, even upper 70s to head towards uh, Di-35 corridor and along the Gulf of Mexico towards Houston. That's because it's more tropical, more humid. That's why they're starting off warmer than we are here in, the, in West Texas. Zooming into West Texas, we are clear. No problems for your Monday morning commute, and we're going to stay that way throughout the day today as well. So mostly sunny conditions. We'll have a few clouds, especially in the afternoon and evening hours, thanks to more humidity in place later on today. So we'll see increasing clouds, but still lots of sunshine for your day today. Temperatures mainly in the low 90s for highs. Right about average, our average high is 92 degrees. Nowhere near that record high of 109 set back in 1960. So thankfully well under that. Five-day forecast will start in Abilene. Low 90s for the first part of the week will be in the mid-90s by the middle and end of the week with mainly sunny skies. Same thing for San Angelo. We're staying mainly dry over the next five days. May see a sprinkle or two because of that humidity, uh, but no big storm system over the next five days. And temperatures slowly stair climbing up. We'll be flirting once again with those triple digits by the end of the week into the coming weekend. So pretty average June-like weather expected across the area this week. So nothing crazy. That's some good news. But get outside now while we're in the 60s. Beautiful morning to start off your Monday. We'll have much more Wake Up West Texas coming up after the break.